Alright guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to install my TAP Performance Slip-On Muffler onto my 2018 Harley-Davidson Sport Glide. Alright, I have been waiting anxiously for this thing. Ever since I got my new bike, I have always said it needs to be louder and it's finally going to be today. This is the TAB Performance 4-inch muffler slip-on with the zombie baffle. So it should be the loudest that they offer for this slip-on for this bike. So let's install this thing. And all the tools we should need for this install is a ratchet with a 9-16 hex bit socket as well as a 7 16 hex bit socket and I'm going to be using a 3 16 hex key let's do it alright so what's good about this exhaust is you can reuse the stock heat shield so we will be reusing all of this right here but we are going to be replacing this so first we gotta undo a clamp here and take our ratchet this should be a 9 16 then we're going to crack that off first. Then there are two bolts underneath here that I've already got loosened up that I need to come out too. Those are what hold the muffler and heat shield onto the bike. So let's go ahead and get all this taken off. Now I did loosen all this stuff already like I said because it was pretty a pretty big pain in the butt because you have to put a lot of oomph especially into this, this clamp here. I'm going to take my 3 16 Allen key or you can use a ratchet and and such and we're gonna reuse this hardware too so don't lose it all right so we're just gonna hold on to the muffler and the heat shield and wiggle it and see how easy this comes off there we go pretty easy just wiggle right off all right now for the tab I'll put the part number in the description below for this guy, but it does come with a new clamp that you will use, and that is what we're using the 7 16 X bit ratchet socket for. And there it is. Yeah, I would recommend for an install like this to put down a soft cloth. I got like a nice fleece cloth here that I'm going to put down and sit all my stuff off while I'm working on it before we get it put back on. Alright, so it looks like there's two hose clamps here that we're going to have to loosen to pull this old muffler out. And it looks like we can use a to take that out. So let's grab that and we'll get these taken off loosened. Then we'll put the new one on. And there's the stock muffler. Goodbye, won't need you again. All right, so we're gonna put the new one in the exact same way. So I got it kind of set here how I took this one out. I'm just gonna go ahead and slide it right on in here. That's what she said. And there's a little line here that looks like it should line up where the end of the heat, heat shield goes. You'll probably see the logo sticking out. All right, so we're gonna tighten these back up, put the hose clamp on, slip it back on, tighten everything up, get it on the bracket, and we should be good to go. Alright, so once they're all tightened up, we're going to put on the clamp onto the head here, and then we'll get it bolted on. And this is where you're going to use your 7 16 hex bit socket on your ratchet. Alright, so before I tighten here, I'm going to put the two bolts in here loosely by hand. Work it in pretty well, get those holes lined up. We're going to reuse the stock hardware. Take the socket, tighten it down. Right then I'm going to go under here and tighten these up really well too. There's tour specs for all of this. I'll put them here and in the description below. And I'll cut out that part of this video so we'll just get to the sound next. So let's tighten these up and let's listen to it.
All right, so let's listen to a sound test before. That was a really easy install. So here's a before, and then we'll show an after right afterward. All right, so you guys are probably wondering, what does it sound like when you're on the bike? Well, we're gonna do a test ride tomorrow and see how it sounds. Heck, I may even do one today, but we're gonna listen to it rip. Well guys, there you have it. I must say I am very, very impressed with this exhaust. Tab, shout out to you guys. You guys made a great product. I'm very happy with it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video today. Please hit that subscribe button, hit that like button if you like this video, and leave me a comment, let you know what you think of the new Tab exhaust. Until next time, this is D-Cycle signing out, saying take it sleazy. I'll see you in the next video.